Every year in elementary school, I got first place for the library art contest. Except for, I want to say it was fourth grade. And Miles Sorsinski, he won first place. Your direction is determined by the destination of where you want to be. The illusion of light to me is a good light source in a tattoo. And the key to it, the key to a believable light source in a tattoo is relativity. He you know, made the best of you know, what he had available to him and managed to come up from the ashes to be one of the most respected artists in our industry. I started tattooing in the uh, summer of 99. Uh, after about a year long back injury. When you think you can do it and then you fall short and there's nothing that pushes you harder to try next time than falling short. Well, Jeff's just been one of the sort of new wave of art focused tattooers who are bringing outside artistic knowledge into the tattoo art form, in, into the tattooing craft. Um, to me, what a, a successful tattoo needs contrast, and contrast is simply two opposing elements that work against each other. You kind of get the impression that each, each tattoo has a meaning to him as well, that there's a story to it for him, and I think that you can kind of see that in the work, the amount of love and you know the amount of talent that goes into it. Layout and transitions on any tattoo is super important because you're talking about a person here. You're talking about a person's body. Contrasting color is the same thing as values, except it's color. I want you to realize that all, all I can share is my experience and hope that it triggers things in you.